Hi guys, Jay Smith here. Welcome to the Ask Golf Nut channel. So today it's a preview, not a review, it's a preview of the 923 Forge and the 923 Tour. Now, I've got the DNA heads here, so shaftless on this one. Um, it allows me to keep the same shaft and flop, uh, swap over heads, uh, flop over heads, flip over heads, whichever one it'll be, um, and keep apples for apples testing, because we like that. I've already hit these um, and to see how they feel. The, this one has a change, the 923 Tour has a distinct change. And this will be for the players, remember. The 923 Tour is a proper player's iron now. When it comes to the size of this thing, um, well, the, the, the tall irons weren't very big really anyway, um, but now, if anything, I mean, look at the top line on that. Yeah, you could butter your toast with that. Um, it's tiny, which it looks a lovely uh, uh, looking iron. But when it comes to the internals, there's a slight change to the internals of the tour this year, which will be interesting for the players out there when it comes to feel. When it comes to the 923 4s, there is some change when it comes to the internals of this thing. Yes, there is. Is it going to be a revolution for Mizuno? No. Possibly with the exception of the 900 forged, every single step after that has been evolutionary step up. The 900 forge was a little bit, it, low, it didn't launch very well and stuff like that. So as soon as they brought it out, the 919 forge, it was instantly changed. So that was a massive jump where since then it is evolutionary steps. And this is gonna be no different to this. So we're looking at a slight increase in performance, a slight increase in forgiveness, etc. when it comes to the lovely MOI ratings that we like. Um, but remember guys, for the testing, that I do and comment below if you know of another channel that does this I think I'm the only channel on YouTube who tests golf equipment that does this kind of test that when I'm testing golf equipment I don't just test it out the middle because every golf club will work really well out the middle I test out of the toe I test out the heel and low and all those spots which amateur golfers hit it and then I measure it and see how much drop off it has compared to a middle hit, effectively forgiveness testing. Um, and then I'll put that up on the end of the reviews and stuff like that. So make sure you go down there, get the old subscribe button on, definitely do that one. And then while you're there, hit that bell icon. That bell icon is a notification bell and that will notify you on the 19th or whenever I do compares, because I'm just going, obviously I'll do the reviews and stuff, but I'm going to do some compares against possibly 921 forged against the 923, the new G430, which is coming out. And there's so many different reviews that we could be doing when it comes to this. So make sure you get the subscribe button on, make sure you get that bell icon on, because obviously, yeah, I'm going to be doing lots more stuff with these. So anyway, very quick preview of what it looks like. There's got slight changes when it comes to the uh, forged, to bring it more in line when it comes to the new looks of the 923 hot metals, but they're making it somewhat sleeker. And there's some change in the internals as well, which we'll go through in the full review. And then when it comes to the 923 tour, some interesting change to the internals, um, and they've changed the aesthetics a little bit as well. So we'll go into that one in the full review. So anyway, hope you liked it. If you did, go on, give it a like, go on YouTube likes it, so do I. Subscribe, get that bell icon on while she's down there. Go on, click that red button, click that bell icon on because we're gonna be doing some fun and full testing with these very soon.